Welcome to digitalconstructive.com and in this video we're going to be taking a quick look at the North Carolina electrical license. Now below this video we've got timestamps that'll take you to specific sections of the video so you can find the information you're looking for as quickly as possible. Now in the state of North Carolina, electricians are governed by an agency known as the Board of Examiners of Electrical Contractors. And there are three separate levels of an electrical license that you can get. You've got the limited, the intermediate, and the unlimited. The limited allows you to do projects not exceeding $60,000 and no more than 600 volts, but you'll need at least two years of experience. Now, one of those years of experience will need to be what is known as primary experience. And this is gained by the applicant while engaged directly in the installation of electrical wiring and equipment governed by the National Electric Code, or the NEC, or work activities directly related thereto. Now, when it comes to the intermediate, this allows you to do projects not exceeding $150,000. But for this one, you'll need at least four years of experience. Two and a half of those years will need to be primary experience. Now, lastly, for the unlimited license, you'd be able to do projects of any size. You'd need at least five years of experience in supervision, directing, electrical wiring, and electrical installation projects. And at least four of those years will need to be primary experience. Now, again, you'd also need a written statement from at least two people attesting to your knowledge. Remember, primary experience is gained by the applicant while engaged directly in the installation of electrical wiring and equipment governed by the National Electric Code or work activities directly related thereto. So you definitely want to remember that when you're choosing a level of electrical license in North Carolina. Now, in addition to the three levels, there are seven different special restricted license types. And these are specific areas of expertise within the electrical trade that you can go for. So you definitely wanna check those out if you specialize in any one of these areas. We'll cover these restricted license types in a different video, but you should know that they do exist. Now, when it comes to the requirements of any license, you've got to at least be 18 years of age. You'll need to possess good moral character and supply two written statements. You'll need to meet the experience requirements. You'll need to be approved through an application to take the exam. And then obviously you need to pass the exam. Now, when it comes to the exam, there's going to be a lot of electrical concepts that you'll need to know in order to pass. So bonding and grounding, wiring methods and terminations, boxes and fittings, service entrance and equipment, motors, control wiring, load calculations. You'll obviously also be tested on North Carolina laws and rules. So that's definitely something you want to be familiar with. Um, we've got information covering every aspect of the North Carolina electrical exam, all the different levels, because obviously they're going to fluctuate based on which level you're going for. But you can find those links in the description below. We've got practice exams and courses designed to help you pass not only electrical, but also the North Carolina law and business portion. Now, when it comes to the most current fees and applications, these are obviously changing. So we always keep those up to date in the links below. You can find out the most current fees for the North Carolina electrical license, as well as the applications. Definitely check that out. I hope you found this video helpful. Like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Again, this is digitalconstructive.com. And thanks again for watching.